Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum and good day. Today uh, I'm going to present about the project for flow assurance in pipeline flow lines. This one is the slide presentation. Let's start. All right. Uh, the title of our project is CFD Evaluation of Erosion for Multiple Angle Pipe Elbow in Solid Liquid Flow. This one, uh, these are the names for our project team member. Muhammad Farhan bin Muhammad Yatim, 24769. Nasrullah bin Abdullah Saloji, 24785. Muhammad Fakhru Razi bin Azizi, 2668. Hamizan bin Yaakob, that's me, 23804. Moving to the next slide. The outlines are the first one, introduction, problem statement, objective, scope of study, literature review, methodology, and lastly, the conclusion. Uh, all right, for the introduction, one of the main ways that crude oil is currently damaging the environment is by leaking it from natural deposits. During oil production upstreams, sand from reservoirs is often transported to wellheads and from wellheads to discharge stations. Sand erosion causes significant damage to critical components of transport and processing equipment such as valves. Equipment for Oil production and refining is damaged due to erosion. And the sand erosion is a complex process that depends on many parameters such as properties of sand and traces of particles, fluid flow. Next, moving to the problem statement. A large angle of redirection of flow affects more on the formation of erosion. High velocity rate causes to erosion damage the flow changing devices. The objective of our project is to evaluate the effects of solid particles in multiple angles of pipe elbow with oil as a working fluid. The objective of our project is to evaluate the effects of solid particles in multiple angles of pipe elbows with oil as the working fluid. All right. Next, scope of study. To analyze the erosion on different angle elbow as geometry of study by using ANSYS 19.2 academic fluent. Working fluid engine oil, density of the engine oil, 889 kilogram per meter cube, solid particle using sand. The aim is to analyze how real industry situation which oil is used as working fluid and how the physical properties affect the erosion. Different angle pipe and bow is used using the same length to see the effect of the geometrical change to the erosion pattern. Next, literature review. Same find erosion in gas pipelines. Experiments and CFP modeling by Parvin Kumarji, Biron Smith, RJ, the modern Vedapuri, 2014. CFP model carried out using an air or sand system, using an air sand system, and the flow is carried out for 14 hours. The geometry specification using diameter of 2 inches, elbows elbow angle 90 degree material use carbon steel standard for ASTM A106 granite A, A106 grade B sand properties using AGSCO quartz 325 mean diameter 28 microns density 2650 kg per meter cubic fluid properties viscosity 1.8 times 10 power of negative 5 kg per second hmm. density 101.125 kg per meter cube flow rate 32.2 meter per second all right the discussion for the literature review 
graph of this paper. First one, the erosion rates increase from the index up to, the, to a sweep angle of 80 degree and decreases towards the first elbow outlet. Okay, at all, model was the most accurate at predicting the thickness loss for elbow one, despite the displaced location of the erosion. Due to the pipeline line between the first and second elbow, it is shown that the, the more erosion occurs toward the outlet of the elbow rather than the inlet. The third elbow has erosion results dissimilar to the first elbow, both with maximum thickness loss fit. This experiment shows that the OKA at all model was the most accurate model in comparison to the other models. Moving to the next literature review by Xiao Kurwi and Yung Jian Yap, 2019. Objective investigate sand erosion behavior in 3 inches diameter pipe with CFD. Problem statement simulation of the fine sand particles tend to over predict erosion result hence does not reflect actual case. Geometry specification using diameter 3 inches, elbow angle 30, 45, 60, and 90 degrees, inlet length 1000 millimeter, outlet length 600 millimeter, material standard steels 316, three properties, water, viscosity 1, 0 0.003 and stand power of negative 3 kg per meter, meter per second per meter second density 998.2 kg per meter cube and viscosity of 1.8 times 10 power of negative 5 kg per meter square per, per meter second density 1.125 kg per meter cube discussion of this paperwork is the liquid solid flow had erosion focused at the side of the elbow with lower erosion rate. Gas solid flow had erosion at the outer radius of the elbow with high erosion rate. For most accurate results, use in the velocity of 27 meter per second as the error yielded is 7.43%. The simulation should not be performed with uniform particle size. Okay. The paperwork is from is from Parsi M Agrawal M Srini Vasan V Viera Avi Torres C F Matlauri B S and Shirazi S A 2015. Review outcomes tackles the erosion rate in the flow line at different flow rates of the fluid and reflects the gas flow rate to study the change in erosion. Uses varying sizes of same particles in the fluid mixture to see the difference in erosion rate. Uses water and air as, fluid, as working fluids. Particle tracking and erosion modeling was applied for the simulation. The methodology of our project are setting the geometric, part, geometric parameters for 60 degree elbow, 90 degree elbow, and 120 degrees elbow. The diameter are the same for all angles, which is 50.8 millimeter. Diameter outlet D2, 50.8 millimeter, the same diameter. The length L1, which is one, are 1016 millimeter same for all the angles line two this one 508 millimeter same for all three angles and the radius of the radius <coughs> radius right? oh okay the radius this one is 76.2 millimeters and the angles are 60, 90, and 20, 120. These are the mesh generated for all the elbows. 60 degree elbows, 90 degree elbows, and 180 degree elbows. Mesh number one and number two, number three. Element size of mesh number one, 30. Number of elements 81,002. Mesh visualization of the outlet like this. 
The second one is 25 element size. Number of element 136,619. This one is the mesh visualization. And the third one, the element size is 20. Number of elements of 108,700. This one is the screenless mesh matrix. Range of excellent, very good, good, acceptable, bad, unacceptable. The next one is orthogonal quality mesh matrix. Unacceptable, bad, acceptable, good, very good, excellent. <coughs> Simulation parameters. The target surface area, steel, erosion particles, sand, particle diameter, 50 miles, particle diameter distribution, rosin, ramble, particle density, 1650 kg per meter cube, particle shape, uniform sphere, turbulent model, reliable, absolute, working fluid engine oil. Results and discussion. We can see from this diagram are the erosion rate using the NCS 19.2 for all the elbows, say degree elbow, 90 degree elbow, and 120 degree elbow. These are the graph of erosion rate per second versus the ang elbow angles for 16 degree for 90 degree and for 120 degrees conclusion and future work at the same fluid velocity decrease in the elbow angle will see an increase in erosion rate Highest erosion rate is experienced by 60 degree elbows. Lowest erosion rate is experienced by 90 degree elbow. Since for this project, in three different angles with with same surface material, which is steel, maybe in the future, if surface material can be tested. For example, using cast iron, polymer, or galvanized iron. Alright, that's all of our video presentation. Thank you.